All right guys, the OnePlus 13 has been one of my favorite phones that I've ever used. But not every phone is absolutely perfect. And this one is no exception. So there have been a couple of bugs I've been dealing with, but there is one bug that is impacting a lot of people. So I wanted to make a video on it. I found a solution on how to resolve this issue and I wanted to share it with you guys. So on the OnePlus 13, there is a weird notification issue and I believe it's due to battery optimization and um, the aggressiveness of OnePlus's killing of background apps, right? For example, say I have my phone laying on my table, right? And um, a important notification comes to you from Teams. There have been situations to where that actual notification does not reach the phone itself in a timely manner. So maybe a couple of hours before that notification comes to, or you may not get it at all. So I have found a solution to this. So what you guys want to do is locate the app in question that you are having notification issues with. Head over into settings, scroll down until you locate apps, go to app management, scroll down until you find the app in question, boom, Teams. And this is all of the app settings for this particular app, right? So you would then want to go down to battery usage and you want to make sure to allow background activity. So this allows the application to run in the background, which will use more battery. But if it is a very important app, I would highly suggest you guys going ahead and turn this on. So we'll go ahead and allow background activity and it'll give you just a little bit of a explanation of what it's doing. So we'll go ahead and allow it. So then you'll want to jump back and you'll want to uncheck this option here, which is manage app if unused. So for example, say um, I use work for Teams, which I do, and uh, I didn't use Teams for an entire week. OnePlus will go ahead and manage this app to where it'll save you more battery in the long run, but it will prevent this app from working properly in the background. So what you wanna do is uncheck that, and that will allow the app to, to stay in its normal state for longer. Now, these things you've probably seen before, but you wanna jump back back again all the way back to your application settings and then you'll want to go down to about device scroll down to see version and then what we are going to do is turn on developer options and you can do this by clicking on the version number option 10 times and then you'll put in your password so now it'll say you are now a developer so then we'll jump back again jump back again and then you'll jump over to system and update. Now have the developer options option. Go ahead and click on that. And the setting we are looking for is the suspend execution for cached apps. And we will want to disable that option. So we'll scroll down until we find that. Scrolling down here. So you want to keep scrolling until you get to the apps option. And then you'll want to locate this suspend execution for cached apps. So we'll go ahead and click on that. And you'll want to disable this option. Now, once you disable this, your phone must be rebooted in order for this to take effect. So we'll go ahead and reboot. Guys, while we are rebooting, go ahead and shoot this video a like and go ahead and subscribe. That way you don't miss any of my OnePlus content. I plan to have a lot of videos on this phone, a lot of tips and tutorials, extended reviews, camera reviews, etc. Go ahead and like this video if you appreciate the work I'm doing here. So guys, give this a shot. Try it out and let me know if this works for you. Now, I used it in Teams, but I haven't really had any other issues with any other apps, right? So go ahead and give this a shot. Let me know in the comments if this has helped you. It took a couple of hours for me to notice that the change was now working. So give it a little bit of time and um, hopefully this helps you guys out. There's not many people talking about this on YouTube. Um, so I wanted to make sure to get this video out for you guys. So like I said, go ahead and subscribe if you enjoyed this video, and I appreciate you for checking this out. See you next time.